Looking a little bit like something you might see at NASA, this is Delara's driver simulator. And there's only two of these in the world. They both happen to be here in Italy. The first is in Ferrari, the second is at the Delara facility. Now, Delara and Ferrari did a joint project, but Delara holds the patents on these actuating arms and on the projection system that gives you that real life feel. But you don't want to think about this as a super expensive, just driver experience. This is much more an engineering exercise about generating data. When you think about a driver who takes a car out and tests on a racetrack, you also think he pulls into the pits and then you have an engineer that plugs his laptop in and gets that ultra important data. Well, that's what this is for, to generate that very same data and that's sent via all these cables to the control room. Up here, the data, of course, is monitored by the simulator technicians. But as a race engineer, you could slide yourself here down into the third station, bring your laptop computer with a password encrypted file and run setup changes that those technicians don't need to know what you're running. Now many of the IndyCar teams have taken advantage of the facility here in Italy and most recently, KV Racing Technology and Simona de Silvestro. I've never been in a simulator, so it was a really new experience for me and for the, for the team too. You know, they got to try uh, different things, different setups, uh, and you know, you do a lot of laps, you can do the changes really quick in the, in the simulator, so you can learn a lot in a really short time. Now this entire facility costs over 13 and a half million dollars to produce, so this is definitely the most expensive vehicle that I will ever drive, so if you make a mistake here in turn number one or coming up here in the short shoot, thankfully the computer can just reboot, much different than the real world, but I suppose there is one thing this doesn't have, and that's its own commentary, but we can provide that. 